All right, welcome back to the channel. So I know this is a little bit late, uh, but I did want to upload. Uh, these are my final three fights against the champion. Um, I'm only including the final 10% because uh, I think that's what most people have the most trouble with. So this first one is Thing against Champion, and this is No Retreat and Burden of Might. Uh, this was probably the toughest note combination I did. Um, with Thing, there's a specific strategy. Right now, what I'm doing is basically nonsense, but you need to start the fight by parry, back up, parry, back up. You need to get to your 20 rock stacks, um, and then don't block. Just let him hit you. It'll keep triggering the protection. Um, back up into the corner and you'll be able to dex his specials again don't block if you block you're gonna take a ton of damage just back up into the corner and dex anytime he throws a special um, I nearly got this on the first try uh, but burden of might triggered right as I got my fifth charge and I ended up getting hit and killed but this time I got it so this was burden of might and a retreat uh, so this one right here is just, um, I believe it's like one of the aspect of death nodes. Uh, but as long as thing has protection, it doesn't do anything. So basically this is the equivalent of doing the easy path. Uh, but again, parry, back up, parry, back up. You can do a few hits uh, just to build his power. Um, this was uh, by far my best attempt I ever had. Uh, if you look at my health bar, I'm over 90% and I'm already at what? four prowess charges. Uh, this is just a little rock'em sock'em just for fun. Uh, but boom, five charges, SP3, and the fight is over. Uh, this was easily the best attempt um, at doing the final 10% that I ever had. Um, so you can see I finished the fight actually with 95% uh, of my health. So you can do it with Thing without potting up. Um, generally, I did find it better to put some potions into him to get more health because um, you don't always trigger the protection and having a little more health just makes it less likely that you'll get to three or four and then something just goes a little bit wrong. And this is my final one. This is actually with Morningstar. So with Morningstar... Um, I only healed her to 40%. I didn't uh, put potions into her or anything. Um, the idea is that her perfect block and her healing will keep you alive. Um, I don't know why that first SP1 dex wasn't a dex. Um, some people said it was too late. Um, and maybe it was. Uh, I thought some of the dexes I, I have in this fight actually were pretty good. Um, but I, I didn't get any of them. Um, so you can see, like, I didn't get that one, and I thought I waited um, as long as I could. Uh, but you can look at my health. So right there, that SP2 got me some health. Uh, that one didn't. Um, but so I'm, I'm still at no prowess charges. I uh, didn't get that one either. Um, so here I just threw the special to kind of get create some space. Uh, her SP1 actually creates a lot of space. So this SP2, again, got me a little bit of health. Uh, that was the first prowess charge. This SP2 uh, shot me back to nearly full health, uh, which is pretty crazy. Uh, so there I got a second charge. Again, just used the SP1 to get him off. Uh, this one basically healed me to full. Um, so right at this point, I kind of thought, oh, I actually might, uh, might be able to get this. Um, I don't actually remember what the node was on this, um, but this was the do you bleed path. Um, I don't think it was any any serious node. So this special three. Um, so this SP3 was basically just to create some space. And because you don't need to ever be at three bars of power, you always want to be at two bars, ideally, because that's what uh, can help you heal. So I have four prowess here. Uh, there's the fifth. Mystic Dispersion kicks in. Boom. Special two to finish the fight. Uh, so yeah, this was the fight that got me 100% on 6.2 uh, so thank you for watching hopefully if you haven't done these fights some of these tips help you if um, you have questions feel free to leave comments and have a good day